Valtteri Bottas pops the car into pole position. Stoffel Van Dorn watching from the Mercedes pit now. He's the official reserve driver for Mercedes and there was a question whether he would get the drive uh, that George Russell has in fact taken. But there you are, the onboard view with George Russell and getting ready with a completely clear view in front of him for the first time in his Formula One career to not have a car directly in front of him. Just one car ahead of him on the grid, but of course off at an angle. Last few cars moving into position, and it is uh, Pietro Filipaldi. Here you are, riding on board with him, who brings the Haas into 20th place. Valtteri Bottas on the right, George Russell on the left. He's never scored points in 36 Grand Prix. He's about to battle with three drivers who've won 20 Grand Prix between them. Lights out, and away we go. It's a good start by Russell. It's a good start by Russell, but now it's messed up and trying to get between the two Mercedes. No, not quite. Russell's got the inside line down into turn one. Bottas will try and go round, but it's Russell. Russell who leads as he goes into the first corner from Bottas in second, and he's under pressure from Verstappen. Look at Perez. Perez is going for it. Yeah, and Perez has got the momentum. He's going to go down the outside, and there's a spinner behind. Was that the Haas? And now George Russell has, and there's contact with the Ferrari. That's Leclerc. And Perez. Uh, and Perez, so will they get going? Will this be a safety? Meanwhile, George Russell thinking Verstappen oh, in the barrier as well. This will be a safety car, and all George Russell's good work is going to be neutralized. What a brilliant start to this race. That was incredible that he got off the line so well. But Max Verstappen out of the Grand Prix already. Charles Leclerc's out. Oh, Mark, that is so disappointing. We were hoping for a great race between this right. guy. Absolutely, for all of us. That is just. So Heartbreaking for the drivers, obviously, but for us as fans and, and, and the neutrals all going to watch this race, it was teeing up for an absolute, it was going to be a cracker. Bottas, if he gets on the gas, no he doesn't. George aces the start, no Bottas is vulnerable to Sainz and the McLaren. So have a look at this, Carlos Sainz in third place, going for second, potentially down into turn one as George Russell leads the way. Bottas has to defend, Sainz is going to try and go around the outside, it is possible in turn one to do that. He's got the car perfectly positioned and he's into second place. Goal, no. He's run wide, he's run wide, that's going to give Bottas a chance back. Oh, it looking so good initially there, wasn't it? Bottas just on the ropes. And uh, this gives George an opportunity again, he's broke away. And uh, that's crucial for when the DRS comes into play. Get through two without losing too much time. But Albon will still have DRS, but he looks like he's coming out of a bit late. He'll be left with trying to go around the outside. This is the dusty line, does he get track position? Yes, he does. Oh, that's another great outside move by Alex Albon. We've seen him pull off a few of those. And Perez. Perez. Yeah, so Perez getting past Lando Norris. So Lando struggling. It, I wonder, you know, you know that Sainz was talking about deployments. It did look as though they're struggling for straight line speed at that particular section. And he certainly missed out there, didn't he? Yeah, Almond again, sorry, going for the battle down to turn four. Is he going to have a sniff around the outside and do exactly what Albon has done the lap before to get through? Oh, 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 that is a good move. And I tell you what, he's on his way. And that's what you want. You want to try and get someone on their own that are, that are isolated with no DRS in front of them. Oh, it's, it's uh, Williams off. It's Latifi, isn't it? Yeah, parked, yeah, parked that car sensibly, though. That's just down onto the back straight. So I guess they could go virtual safety car. At this stage, because he went very long on his first dip. But can he hold them off for the rest of the race? Yeah, he's under pressure. Well, actually, he's going to see under pressure from his teammate, but he's got DRS as well off the Breno. How hard is he going to defend that one? Yeah, oh, well, he doesn't need to. He locks up and runs wide into four, so that gives the position to Perez. He might have flat-spotted his tyres to boot. Oh, dear. Should he really be fighting that hard against his teammate? Oh, just look at this, Perez. battle here. Perez got DRS as well. That's going to be straightforward in Ocon. Remember what happened to Perez on the opening lap, and he's now got back into third place. He was up here with that incident with Verstappen and Leclerc, had to go into the pits at the end of that lap. And he Power as we speak. Oh, oh wing gone, wing and gone, it's gone, on the front, front. It's on the front. Yeah, yeah this will be a safety car. Hold on, let's have a look. Well, I think he may have spun the car. Coming out of that last corner. Uh, Russell's come in. He's gone long, actually. He's gone long in his box. They've got this little soft, but that's all. I think I've been kind and this is just a absolute mere of a stop, a mere of a stop for Bottas. And why would you double stack him in that situation? It's over. Wrong tyres, is it? Is yeah. this the wrong tyres? I think they're the wrong. They've actually got a little brake fire going on there the issue. Well. They've actually got the wrong tyre going on there. You've got the same ones back on because the other ones aren't oh, legal. Bottas is going to lose a huge amount of time here. Perez 
Williams has moved up into second place. Ocon is into third. Stroll up to fourth. Okay, George, we're going to need to box box. We have a mixed tyre set. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. And they've made a mistake in the pits. They've put the wrong tyres on his car. Sergio Perez lights it up and leads the Grand Prix ahead of Esteban Ocon and Lance Stroll, who nearly made a mistake at the restart. Then behind are the two Mercedes. Bottas under pressure from George Russell. Russell's well placed. Ocon having a little look. Russell goes to the outside. Bottas to the inside of Lance Stroll. In the background, Alex Albon was trying to make a move as well. Yeah, George is nicely positioned out of two. Going through his head, he was... Bottas goes wide in four. Yeah, that was a mistake from Bottas. There's an opportunity. Here comes George. He's going to have a go. Can he keep going around the outside? He's brave, he's brave, he's gone for it. And George Russell's gone past Valtteri Bottas. He's in the fourth place. Oh, what a story this is turning into. It's quick. But let's see if George can... Is he breathing up into one? Or is he going to set him up into four? He's going for it. He's got the inside. Yeah, he's going to go for it. He's done it. And he's into third place again. George Russell back into third place. Can he get the move done up in the top of turn four here? And Bottas, meanwhile, trying to get past Lance Stroll. They're all backing up behind as well with Sainz, Ricardo, and Albert. Here comes George Russell. He's got the inside line. And surely with the grip he's got on those tyres, nothing Ocon can do about it. Oh, we know that racing point's pretty hard to, to clear. As what have we got? A good move around the outside. Here's he having a nibble, and there he is. Go on, Sainz. Go on, Sainz. To Andre Bottas, and he uses the same place that George Russell went past him. Carlos Sainz has taken fifth place in the McLaren, and Bottas is struggling. Oh, he's in trouble, surely, is he? Because now Daniel Ricciardo has got a move on him as well. He's, he's just going nowhere. Yeah, he's about to get passed by the Red Bull as well by being slow off the last corner. And I think was, was that a little puff of smoke? Was a, some contact there between the Mercedes and the Red Bull? No visible damage, but yeah. See how fast that Mercedes is with the DRS, but Albon confident on the brakes. Looks like a rear left puncture. Looks like rear left puncture. Oh no! no! Oh no, you're joking. Rear left puncture potentially on Russell's car. No, no, no. But Sergio Perez wins his first ever Grand Prix. He wins the second Grand Prix, the penultimate race of 2020. It could be the penultimate race of his career, but he's dominated in the end, winning by over 10 seconds. Ocon, his best ever result in second. Stroll makes it a double podium for the Racing Point team. Sainz fourth, Ricardo fifth. Oh, I miss this, guys. Good job, guys. The Mercedes finish eighth and ninth. Sergio Perez has become Grand Prix winner here in the Bahrain. He's brought home the first ever victory for the Racing Point team, a team that he has helped so much over the years. And when it went from Force India to Racing Point, he was instrumental in helping that happen.